like the proverbial cat with nine lives. Mayamala Buni is back on his seat as interim national chairman of the All Progressives Congress alongside the interim secretary, John Apmano Jode. This follows a new deal that is said to be brokered by President Muhammadu Buhari, which will allow the duo to combine their strength with other party members to meet with a new national working committee during the March 26 national convention before their eventual exit. Buni had been purportedly sacked by the president for scheming not to hold the convention of the party. He was then replaced by the governor of Niger State, Abubakar Sani Bello, in an acting capacity until the Independent National Electoral Commission rejected his chairmanship. A letter then surfaced showing that Buni transmitted power to Sani Bello to act until he returns from his medical trip abroad. But Governor Sani Bello denied the existence of the letter initially. Within the same period, the interim secretary of the party, John Abanodode, was said to have resigned. He came out to refute the reports and said he was waiting for the return of his chairman, Maimala Buni, despite attending meetings chaired by Governor Abubakar Sani Bello. Cardinal State Governor Nasir Arifai also claimed that 19 out of the 23 governors of the party were instrumental to Buni's sack. He says the governors discovered that Buni had received a November 18, 2021 court injunction against the party, asking it not to hold a convention and kept it under wraps to be allegedly released three days to the March 26th convention when it would have been too late to vacate the court injunction. But after a letter from Governor Sunny Bello summoned an NEC meeting, INEC denied his leadership, saying he was unknown to the electoral body. APC informed INEC that Sunny Bello was only acting as Boni's deputy. Governor oh, is acting with the full authority of the caretaker committee and with the full authority of the stakeholders and leaders of the party and with the full consent and knowledge of Governor Maimada. This then set a chain of events in action with Budi, Attorney General Abubakar Malami, and many other governors visiting the President in London to confer with him on the developments upon which an unwritten agreement was reached to allow the Buni led caretaker committee to complete its term to avoid legal troubles for the APC. It is on the strength of this agreement that the Interim Secretary, John Abanodode, appeared at the headquarters of the party where he gave a less than 30 minutes conciliatory speech that there's nothing wrong with the APC party. He had previously been prevented from accessing his office. Nigerians that our party is resilient and stronger than ever um, and there is no trouble anywhere in our party. I, I have made a press release which I will circulate to all of you with a press statement. From the turnout of events, it now looks like those who wanted May Malabuni and John Abanodode out of the APC have lost the battle. All is now said for Buni to resume from his medical leave, and some governors are said to be planning a reception for him. But will he upturn the actions of Governor Abubakar Sani Bello, who took some critical steps ahead of the APC National Convention? Ndi Amugo, Arise News.